front of the corazón. She's threatening to beat me. She likes to embellish. She just learned that word on TV. Why are you being so impossible? I'm a teen. Hello, how's my daughter's only friend? Mom, I'm sorry your child has no father, Mrs. Gutierrez. I love the script. Um, I thought the script was really well written, and I love the character of Grace that I play because she was a disaster. I was. I remember when I first started reading the script, I was like ten pages in, and it already had her like smoking in the car with her little girl and her friend, and like you know acting like a child at the principal's office. I was like, this is great. I mean, what? It's an actor's dream to get to play such a flawed character. Sorry, I finished the cereal and the milk. Being a kid is stupid. And I'm moving on. What happened to your teddies? I decapitated them. Grow up. I have to say, it's uh, it was working with such amazing young talent, and I'm serious because you haven't been. You're extremely, extremely again talented, yet you haven't been around and you haven't been jaded. Hey, delicious. When I get back, but please know I'm going to start not doing those. I'm sorry. And there's a protective side of me that wants to kind of keep her that way. <laughs> Although I want you to complete, you know, to succeed, and I know you will. But um, it's just so beautiful to be at the place you're at right now. Aren't we constantly changing throughout our lives? And isn't that a good thing after all? Did you win that? In chess. How nerdy!